My army story has been full of a lot of ups and downs, but the one constant throughout the entirety of it was just a lot of support and love. I have felt so much love and compassion from all of the faculty at RMU, as well as all of the students here, and it's really made RMU feel like a second home to me. I know that no matter where life takes me, no matter the struggles, I can look behind me and I know I have people at RMU that have my back and are gonna be there for me. RMU has given me so many opportunities to build such an incredible community. What makes me unstoppable is that I will never back away from a challenge, no matter what it is. If there's something that needs to get done, I'm there, I'm doing it, and I'm happy to be a part. She's done things that we didn't even dream of doing when we were in college. She's been given opportunities that we would have never even thought to try. We're proud of her. I have been very fortunate to play for the Army women's basketball team for the past three years. My freshman year, not only did I have to go through COVID, but I had to overcome my dad passing away. Overcoming any adversity is what makes me unstoppable and gives me the confidence that I will be the same in the future. She just keeps pushing forward and never falters. I'm a really proud mama, and your dad would be proud of you too, Mackenzie. I've been blessed enough to be part of the men's lacrosse team. Throughout my junior year, we had over 12,000 miles of travel. It was a great challenge, but the professors here helped accommodate it with my schedule. I have awoken a new confidence in me that I did not have beforehand. I came here as a foreign student, not knowing anyone or anything, and I've always had the determination to succeed through those challenges, and that gives me the confidence that I'll be able to be unstoppable in the future. Riley is unstoppable because he's one of seven, so he's the first one to go to college. I think he strives to set examples for his younger siblings. One of the big things that myself and many of the friends that I came to know here, Robert Morris, contributed to the school was a robotics project that has allowed me to come up with ways to go through very challenging situations. And I've taken that mentality in order to see it myself grow in ways that otherwise would not have been possible without the go-to spirit that the school instills in you. I'll be starting as an entry-level software engineer with Bettis in West Mifflin. I will be a state and local tax associate with RSM in Baltimore, Maryland. I will be a pediatric nurse at the Children's Hospital of Pittsburgh on the general thoracic and surgery floor. I will get a master's degree and eventually a doctorate in horticulture and crop sciences. I will be helping small businesses in the Pittsburgh area with their marketing so they can share their stories. I'm going to begin working at KPMG as a state and local tax associate. I plan on continuing my basketball career as I pursue my master's degrees in health and human performance and sports administration. I will be a psychiatric nurse at Metropolitan Hospital in New York City.